welcome to the Discovery Space. My name is Taryn and you can probably tell I'm on our huge ship, our Antarctic research vessel. Now today we're going to be talking about boats. Now it's not only one kind of boat, there's lots of different kinds. There are types of boats like this one here, little rowboats. They've got a point in the front, a square in the back, and they might paddle, people have to push it along to get it moving. So that's one type of boat. Do you know any others? Hmm, I've got a strange boat here. This boat is a sailboat. You can see it's got a big sail, it's so big, it would come all the way up here. So it moves by catching the wind to push it along in the water. And this boat is also special because it's got one, two, it's in the bottom there and a big hole in the middle to help it float and sail across rough waves. So today we are going to make a boat. That sounds pretty hard, doesn't it? But we can do it using all kinds of materials. So some of the things that boats have to do, hmm, the most important thing is they have to float. So we're going to do three things today to make our boats float. We're going to think, we're going to make, and we're going to try it out. So we've had to think about boats, they need to float. Some of them might move by sails, some of them might move by rowing. Some of them, like this one, might be really big and hold lots of people. This one here still has that point in the front and a big rectangle in the back. So today my boat I'm going to make is I'm going to make a boat from Lego. Now you can make a boat from Lego as well, or you can have a look around your house and see what other materials you have to make a boat. So I'm going to start really simple. I'm going to think. The first thing I want my boat to do is I want it to float. So I'm going to make something out of Lego that I think might float. So I'm going to clip my Lego together. Hmm, I think I might try and make one like our catamaran with two long pieces on the side and a bit of a hole underneath. Um, not that one, this one here. Mm. Get some long pieces of Lego for this. boat to start with to see if it floats. So let's have a look. I've got some water here and you could use a tub, you could use a bowl, you could use your bathtub, whatever you might like. And I've also set down a bit of a mat at the bottom just in case there's any spills. So you might want to add a towel at home. Now let's test out to see if this boat works. <gasps> okay, so my boat is floating. You can see if I move the water, the boat stays afloat. So I've had to think about my boat, and I've made it, I've tried it out, and it floats. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to think, how can I make this boat better? And I'm going to make some changes to make my boat even better. Mm, I'm going to try and make my boat taller. Um, so I'm going to add some big pieces in the middle. I wonder how this will go. like a sail for our sailboat. Hmm. So, I've done made some changes. Let's try again. Oh, it still floats, but not very well this time. Hmm. I might have to think about that and make some more changes. This time, I'm going to try and make it bigger, but not taller. So I'm going to take this away, and I might... Add some bits to the end. I'm going to put some bits here to make it longer. And across the back. And I might fill these in here to make our platform. Just like that. Now, those boats that we looked at before, they had a square at the back, but they had a bit of a point at the front. So I'm going to try that now as well. See if I can do a good point at the front. And so if I put this in here, 
that there, just like that. But it's not quite a point yet. I might need a few more pieces. Oh, that looks like a bit of a triangle at the front there. And let me just fill it in like that. Now, let's give this boat a try. Ah, oh, that boat floats as well. So we've made a big boat, I've made some changes, and now I've made a boat that I'm pretty happy with. I think that one works well, and it floats around. I wonder where this boat might go. So now my challenge for you is, can you make your own boat at home? Could you make it out of Lego, and does it float? Maybe you'll have to make some changes like I did. It might not work every time, but that's okay. Because remember those three things we do. We think, we make, and we try. And then we go back, we think, make and try again. So you could use Lego, you could use whatever you want. Send us the pictures of your boats floating at your house. And we get all of our boats together. So have fun building boats. See you next time. Bye.